There are certain things we've been told in our lives that we always just kind of believed. Well, I'm here to tell you that some common sayings are definitely not true at all. Like, all is fair in love and war. Really? How sad would that be? How about the phrase, a stitch in time saves nine? And I mean, come on, there's no way that everybody was kung fu fighting. There is one historic innovation that's part of the fabric of our lives, and that could back up that whole stitch in time saying. But seriously, even for the professionals, those cats weren't as fast as lightning. The sewing machine doesn't date back nearly as far as that ancient martial art, but its invention was a kind of art all its own. The early models, which displayed distinct elegance, entered American life in the mid-1800s. The first sewing machine that turned out to be a prototype for many that came after, that sewing machine was made by Elias Howe in 1846. But it was Isaac Singer who created the first practical sewing machine. I met domestic life curator Jeannie Miller at Firestone Farm in Greenfield Village to talk about the move from hand sewing to the sewing machine. Sewing was as integral to home life as cooking? Abs absolutely it was. A woman might make hundreds of garments in her lifetime for her family. And this really was considered women's work? It was, yes, at that time. And young girls were always taught to sew. The development of the sewing machine, how much did that change life for women? The sewing machine changed life for everyone, okay. not just women. And that's because it really helped expand the ready-made clothing industry. And what do you mean by ready-made clothing? That's where you can go into a store like we do today and find a shirt and buy it right off the rack. As opposed to buying the fabric that you then have to assemble. Right, rather than having to cut and sew the fabric and fit it all yourself. Another turning point came when Isaac Singer's company made the sewing machine more accessible for people who wanted to have one in their home. This company had one of the first installment plans to buy the sewing machine, yes, so that you didn't have to have the money all up front and you could acquire a machine and pay it off over time. So Singer didn't just innovate with the sewing machine itself, he innovated in terms of how it was paid for. Absolutely. Jeannie and I decided to put our own skills to the test in the form of a competition. And Jeannie gave me the advantage of using the 1880s white sewing machine while she volunteered to sew by hand. The goal of this is, uh -huh. is to sew not only quickly, but also with even stitches uh -huh. and in a straight line. Uh -huh. So you think you're ready? Okay, yeah, the goal of this is to win. Ready, set, go. Can I switch legs? Can I switch legs? Oh. Okay, are you done? I think so. All right, how much did you get? I got a lot. A lot. So if you've got any potatoes, I'd be happy to carry them for you. It's a nice potato bed. <laughs> <laughs>